celebrations and gunfire at Tripoli International Airport. Forces allied with the UN-supported government say they've now taken control of all entrance and exit points in the key city of Tripoli, after capturing the airport from Khalifa Hifter's rival forces. <laughs> It would mark another defeat for Hifter's East-based Libyan Arab Armed Forces, but analysts warned it was too early to conclude that the fighting over Tripoli was finished. Since 2015, Libya has been divided between two governments, one in the east and one in the west. Hifter's East-based forces launched an offensive in April last year to capture Tripoli from the west-based Government of National Accord. The offensive has had the backing of Russia, France, Egypt and the United Arab Emirates. Its troops had made some gains around the capital in recent months. Meanwhile, on Thursday, Libya's UN-backed Prime Minister Fayez al-Sarraj met with Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan in Ankara. Turkey backs the West-based government of National Accord along with Italy and Qatar. Thursday's events came shortly after the UN announced Libya's warring parties had agreed to resume ceasefire talks after weeks of heavy fighting.